Here we have another female model and the baby grows inside of the uterine cavity. And right here, this part is what we call cervix. And through the cervix, we have the cervical canal. So right this part is the uterus and right here is the cervix. Now, this is the fornix, the vaginal canal, and here we have the vaginal orifice. If we look at this view, we can see here the one tube between two ligaments. So this is the uterine tube. Anteriorly, we have the round ligament. And going towards the ovary, which is this yellow structure, we have the ovarian ligament. The ovary is the female gonad. So the egg is produced here in the ovary and then it's released basically into the pelvic cavity and then it's picked up by the fimbri and then the egg will go through the uterine tube which brings the egg towards the uterine cavity that we are seeing right here at the end of the uterine cavity we have the fundus now if we look right here this is the uterus and then you know that this is the anterior aspect and this is the posterior aspect because here you have the rectum. So if this is the rectum, you have the posterior aspect right here. Consequently, now you can see that from the uterus to the posterior aspect, we have a ligament. And this ligament is the one that connects the uterus to the sacrum. Consequently, this is the uterosacral ligament. And all these that we are seeing right here, all this rubber, let's look at the other view. So basically, all this rubber that you're seeing here, which is very broad, this is all named the broad ligament. I just mentioned that this is the ovary, which is the female gonad. And then we see that we have blood vessels coming towards and leaving the female gonad. And this is the ovary. So this artery that we see right here bringing blood towards the ovary, this is the ovarian artery. And we see the vein, which takes blood away, and this would be the ovarian vein. When we look at the other model, we can see the blood vessels right here as well. So this one that's coming towards the ovary is the ovarian artery, and the blue one is the ovarian vein.